Two tornadoes causing most of the major damage that we're seeing in Kentucky. Meteorologist Alden German went on a storm survey with the National Weather Service in Taylor County. He shows us the damage they found and the stories of those who survived. Homes flattened, trees stripped, cars tossed, a life lost. In rural Taylor County, Kentucky, near the small town of Saloma, Residents save what little possessions weren't destroyed from a tornado in the early morning hours of December 11th. Amanda Dye was alone when the EF3 tornado leveled her home of nine years. She decided to spend the evening in the basement knowing severe weather was expected. She got the alert a tornado was coming and rushed to take cover. Shortly under, after I get under the stairs, all of a sudden the basement door from the outside just whoosh, just blew into the basement. It took only seconds to wreak havoc. Oh my gosh, the whole house is gone. Uh, the, I didn't see the car. I didn't see the carport. I mean, everywhere I looked, there was nothing. Down the road, Karen Sanders had seconds to react to her phone's weather alert, crouching in front of a recliner as she covered her head while her mother took shelter in a bedroom. Both survived, but their home, built in 1825 and in the family for eight generations, is beyond repair. It's the same story for dozens of others in this small community. Its greatest loss suffered inside a mobile home whose resident never made it out. Her landlord says he never felt so helpless. Days later, the feeling of defeat is turning into hope. We had a gentleman just walk up to us in the yard yesterday and, you know, asked, are you the homeowners? My husband said yes, and he, he just handed him $200. We, were, we don't even know this man. Small gestures from locals and people across the state pouring in to help those affected rebuild. Reporting in Saloma, Alden German, WHAS 11, on your side.